iOS 15 is now available and I'm gonna show you how to manually update your iPhone to the latest operating system. Before I get started, make sure to like and subscribe to How To Do It All for more how-to videos and check out in the description, we have links to more information on the new features in iOS 15. iOS 15 was released on September 20th, 2021 and it came with some new features including spatial audio for FaceTime along with Android and Windows support as well as facial recognition software to help better protect your Apple wallet. You can check out Chris Parker's video on how to use FaceTime with Android and Windows here, click right there. Now you may have seen a notification from Apple to download and install iOS 15 when it was originally released, but in case you weren't ready to do it at the time, here's how to manually download and install iOS 15 right now. But real quick, before we get started, downloading a new iOS app from Apple is always a gamble. There's gonna be lots of bugs, there's gonna be crashes, so it might be worth waiting for 10 days, a couple weeks, or until the next update comes out. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do this on my personal phone because I work for CNET and we need content, damn it. Make sure your phone has enough battery life or is plugged into power. Your iPhone will not let you download the update until you are connected to Wi-Fi and have enough battery life. Open the Settings app and click on General. Then click on Software Update. At the top of the screen, you can change your automatic update settings. Right now, mine is set to download only so I can choose when I want to upgrade my phone to the new iOS. You can select Install iOS Updates and Apple will push the latest update to your phone automatically, which could cause you some issues in the future, so I would be careful with that switch. I like to choose when I get my updates, so I leave that setting off. It's also good practice to back up your iPhone before you do anything, just to be on the safe side. Now you can go back and at the bottom of the screen you will see Upgrade to iOS 15. Click on Upgrade to iOS 15 and you'll be taken to the Download and Install page. Select Download and Install and then enter your phone's passcode. Then agree to the terms and conditions. Now you can choose to continue with cellular data if your phone comes off of Wi-Fi for some reason. Your phone will begin preparing and downloading the update. When it's done, click Install Now. Your phone will do its thing and all you can do is wait till it finishes. When it's done, your phone will restart into iOS 15. You can open the Settings app, go to General, and select About to confirm that you have the updated operating system. Now that you got iOS 15, congrats, but it does come with some risk updating to the latest operating system. You may encounter crashing apps and glitchy bugs that can drive you nuts. So sometimes it's good to wait till Apple has released a patch to fix some of those early iOS issues. If you like this video, like and subscribe to How To Do It All for more how-to videos, and leave us a comment about what you think is the best new feature in iOS 15. And as always, thanks for watching.